<sighs> home sweet home. Is that someone playing in the music box? What the? How can there be a door that... I'd hardly take The door was open. Were they waiting for me? Hmm. There's something on the counter. What was that? Well, if there's someone at home, I'd rather not bother them. I shouldn't answer the phone. Should I?
Hello. Is there anyone there? Ah, nope.
Pucha, jetzt ist er frei.
Are you? It's as if I... What is that thing?
after burning that that horrible thing. Daniel, the do She may be right, Daniel. We need to find her. Weird. It's not like Dad to leave the lights on after closing up. Where did everyone go? Well, I could get there from the store using the basement stairs. Uh Is reinforced with steel. I doubt I could hear anything on the other side. Here you are. Who?
get out of here now! I must be losing my mind. It's gone now, but how did it get in there in the first place? Something's wrong. Dad, where in the world have you gone? I don't remember. Anyway, let's see how much of a mess the house was left in this time.
I could have broken my legs. Too close.
Okay. Let's see whether I'm able to follow the bloody trail. that dad cleaned off in the courtyard. What's that tape doing here? It's gone. What? and you're not Let's see if I can open it with this. Oh no. No. Dad! Dad! That was... I don't know. Um... Just what I was thinking. Thanks for letting me sleep. <clears throat> what? Hey, Sophie? Oh, no. Daniel, are you all right? 
That had not been a night. That had not been. We had no idea how. This is his desk. Let me go. I know the place. You keep searching this area. This place. There's something in the atmosphere. Merino. He's always the same. That man needs a therapist. No. feeling this isn't going to be anything like giving a class. have I gotten into? Uh, this is gross.
old archive. I haven't been here in so long. I think this is part of what Husha was investigating. Let's see. Hmm. It's a book about Argos Le Grant. A biography, or a collection of articles about him, I think. He apparently spent part of his life traveling the world in search of odd, rare events. Rich people stuff. I don't know. The biography suddenly ends right after his last journey. It says here... He returned without his equipment, without the huge amount of money he wasted on the project, and with a simple memento of the music he brought home to his little girls, eight-year-old Delaine and newborn Ariadne. And here's a note from Hasha that says, See the archives, events, newspaper. Is there a newspaper archive over here? Let me go. I know the place. You keep searching this area. I have to find the newspaper Sebastian consulted. Oh, the secretary's office sensor is on. There's something on that table. Mm -hmm. Well, 
Are you there? No one. I should be able to get into the secretary's office now. Something here. A note from a certain Sylvia that says, Professor Husher, remember to pick up your typewriter and the rest of your belongings from the library desk. This is the university library. If you need your own space, you can use your office. If Husher left documents in there, it may be worth taking a peek too. I think this is part of what Husher was investigating. Let me see. Oh, God, did you read that? Argos Legrand, heir to the Legrand family and owner of the LGA Incorporated business conglomerate, has died under mysterious circumstances along with his wife and eight-year-old daughter. It occurred last night at the family's holiday home, where they were spending part of the spring after the famous magnate's most recent trip. While police remain open-minded in their official statements, and maintain that all lines of inquiry remain open. Popular theories suggest that the family fell victim to a violent robbery, leaving the younger daughter, Ariadne, the sole survivor. She is currently safe in police custody. Oh my god, they're all dead. This is a dead end. Husha left some documents at the library. Maybe there's something there. It's all that's left to check. Let me go. I know the place. You keep searching this area.
Oh my god! What was that? Stronger this time. I have to be more careful. Sinister nature. Interesting. Damn it. There was another book about her. Time to move. I have to find it. Nice and warm.
it open. If this works, let's see how much I have left. No time to waste. I have to find Husha. it all caves in. seemed about to cave in.
Almost feels hot in here. Husha must have been here. Stay shut. these years.
Never lived to tell the story. Leave this.
Screw this. I've got to hide. never lived to tell the story.
Good. Bloody hell. Seems like that thing wanted to grab my hand. Shit. Right, something really heavy just crashed on the floor. Smashing.
an earthquake. happening. Oh God. Mr. Husher? Oh shit. Oh shit, shit, shit. Mr. Husher. Oh, no, 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 no. Sebastian. Oh shit. Fuck. Oh, he's dead. Fuck, man. Fuck. This is the same place. The same room. Huh? What's happening? useless lead. Another fucking riddle. I have to get out of here. What the hell? Ah! Holy shit. This can't be happening. I must be seeing things. Oh shit, Dan. Get the fuck up, man. Oh, Mr. No- Husha died. Husha died. Jeremy Hartwood Hospital, or what's left of it. Okay, let's do this. Don't worry, Daniel. I'll find the information you need. I promise.
Oh shit. I almost didn't make it. Damn it. Argos Legrand. How many people will suffer for what you did? almost knocked me out.
be surprised if it works. But let's give it a go. Hi, Ariadne. How are you? Do you feel like talking today? Hmm. You know, I think you're right, but I don't see things like you do. If you don't feel like talking, you can draw. Whatever comes to you first. Turn off the light. It doesn't like the light. The light? Who doesn't like the light, Ariadne? Who is that old lady? It's me. We can listen to your box if you want. Sometimes I hear you playing it when I pass by your room. No. No, you don't hear them. You don't see it or understand it. What don't I see? Tell me how to understand you, Ariadne. Sleep. Like me, in my bed. You want me to sleep with you? It's... It's normal not to want to sleep alone. Sometimes I get scared at night. Not here. At home. Daddy, mommy, and Elaine sleep there. And they understand. Sorry? You mean you want me to sleep at your house? Yes. Sleep there and listen to the song. And then you'll talk to me. Oh, who's this gentleman? Is it your daddy? No. It's Mr. Neuer. This makes no sense whatsoever. What the hell is going on here? Mr. Neuer? In 1920?
think I unblocked the system. There's something that... Am I... dreaming? What... what is this place? Same room, and yet it's not. Wake up. It's me again. What does this mean? Candles have practically melted through and the wax cylinder on the phonograph is about to run out. I saw something. I don't know what I contemplated in my dreams, but it felt so real. It almost felt like I was moving forwards, or rather downwards. But I don't know towards what. So she did as Ariadne said. Another recording from Dr. Prestigard. Let's hear it.
That thing wanted to... to get me. Is this the same dream? The hospital, it can't be real, right? dreams. The coincidences are un- uh. Whoa, what's going on here? This is the same room that appeared in that old film. to make it. She meant. Listen, there's no time to waste. Get out of there. I'll take it from here. Ariadne was right. She was right about everything. I've seen it with my own eyes. Even if it was in dreams, it's true. That place. The presence. I know what I have to do. Now that I'm awake, I need to... I need to get the music box and find a way to take it there. Yes. I solved this riddle. Now that I'm awake, I can put an end to this horror once and for all. Now that I'm awake, I can... I can... Awake.
It's almost over. Just find the box and take it to that place. Come on, you got this. She doesn't answer. I should go inside. Ariadne. I have to find her and ask her about the music box. Mrs. Legrand. Pardon me for barging in like this, but I need that box. The box. The music box I gave you. I need it. Please, tell me where it is. Its box is upstairs. Thank you. I promise I'll free both of us from that cursed thing. There are still two patients who haven't heard the song, but I don't remember who they are. Oh.
see you never. Did it. Everything will be okay, Mrs. Legrand. Ah, and that song will never play in this world again. Oh.